Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be reviewing the brand new Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Velvet uh, Texture Mousses. They're the liquid lipsticks. So this is gonna be a fun one. I'm really, really excited to try these. I feel like lip products have been so, like such a hit lately. And I've been going for every single like new lip launch I feel like lately. So I had to get these. We're gonna try them out, see what they do, and I will let you know if I think they're worth your money. So before we get started, as usual, give this video a big, big thumbs up for me. It is right down there. Please like this, please subscribe, join the family. Thank you so much. But if you wanna see me review these uh, lip liquid lipsticks, stay tuned for the rest of the video. All right guys, I said this in my last video, but I'm gonna say it again. If I am just off today, I am sick, so please just bear with me. I feel like I am just like moving in slow motion and I feel like I'm like jumbling my words and I'm just like, I need to go to bed. But I'm gonna film first and then I'm gonna go to bed. So I have these pulled up on Sephora. I did, I got two shades. I wanted to get one more, but they were sold out of the specific shade that I wanted, which was um, Crush, I think was what it was called. Just looked like a really pretty like beigey nude color, but they didn't have it. So I have two shades that were in stock, but we'll get into that in a second. So again, it's the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Velvet Liquid Lipsticks. Goes for $24 each. I would say pretty standard for a lip product. Um, and then like I said, the shade that I wanted but didn't get was Crush, which is a soft beige. But I did get Parchment, which is a peachy brown. And I got Pure Hollywood, which is a pale mauve nude. Those are just two shades that I thought would suit me pretty nicely, so fingers crossed. And then let's see what the highlights say. Matte finish, liquid formula, without parabens, cruelty free. A velvet smooth lip mousse with weightless, full pigment, true matte color, cushioned, comfortable wear, and a smoothing lip finish. Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Velvet is a velvet smooth lip mousse with weightless, full pigment, true matte color, cushioned, comfortable wear, and a smoothing lip finish that allows you to line and apply with a multifunctional teardrop shaped cushion wand. That sounds really nice. So maybe this is one of those products where we won't need a lip liner. I feel like most times we use them anyways, but hey, maybe this will work with and without. So I'm gonna take these out of the packaging and see that's one of the things that really drew me in when i saw these on the website on sephora was the packaging because it's not your typical like round long tube lip uh liquid lipstick i don't know why that is so hard for me to say today but the shape of these was just so cool to me when i saw them online and honestly they're even cooler in person like i really really love the unique shape that these are and i feel like I say this with like some concealers that have like a different shape as well, but I like that they're not fully round. So you could like set them on your vanity or your table or whatever you're using and they won't like run away from you. They're just gonna stay put because they're flat. So that's really, really nice. And they just look very luxurious. Like whoever did this packaging, give them a raise because this is really, really beautiful looking. I just love it. And these colors seem like they're gonna be really, really beautiful so i'm very excited to try them out so i want to see what this applicator is all about it does have a little bit of a pointed tip i pictured it a little bit pointier to be honest but it looks pretty nice and i could just see how like velvety smooth this is just on this i'm gonna do a little swatch on the back of my hand though and see oh my god this is so pretty guys I'm really excited to try these on now. It feels like I'm putting absolutely nothing on the back of my hand. They're so velvety that it feels like nothing, which is a really good thing. But here are the colors swatched. They're both just stunning. 
they look so smooth they literally look like velvet like it's really 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 pretty and true to what the description said so so far i am very very impressed but now i want to see what they look like on my lips so i am going to do the lighter shade first and then i'll go into the darker shade so pure hollywood is the first one i'm going to try out i'm going to apply it with you guys i'll show you what it looks like then I'm gonna wipe it off, put this one on, show you what it looks like, and then we'll talk final thoughts, show you the results, let you know if I think it's worth your money. So let's start applying. Okay, so here is Pure Hollywood on my lips. So before I apply the other one, I just want to mention just about the color. I really, really love this color. I think it looks really beautiful, actually. But I do think it's a little bit, like, pulling on the cooler side. So I feel like for me personally, I would need some kind of, like, a deeper or warmer lip liner just to, like, soften this up just a tiny bit because it is a tiny bit on the cooler side. And I feel like that doesn't always suit my skin tone. But... It is beautiful, like I love this color so much. So I did wanna let you guys know that, but I think it is beautiful. Anyways, I'm not gonna talk about feeling or anything yet. I'm gonna put the other one on and then we'll talk details afterwards, so. Okay, I am done applying the second one. I am obsessed with this color, you guys. I feel like this one specifically, I would not even need a lip liner with. I could just throw this on and be on my way and it would look perfect. Like this color is so, so pretty. And I'm not one to typically gravitate towards like the brownish colors I feel like I get so nervous with like browns but wearing this right now I think it looks stunning I love it I'm obsessed with the way it looks I'm obsessed with the way they feel also they just feel so comfortable to wear like when I'm just talking or just like not focusing on my lips it literally feels like there's nothing on them like it feels like i'm not wearing any product on my lips whatsoever but when i like touch my lips together to like smooth them out they literally feel so velvety like just like the description it feels so nice they don't feel drying at all which is so important i feel like liquid lipsticks are so hard sometimes because as soon as they dry down it feels like cement on your lips almost and i hate that feeling so much like a lot of liquid lipsticks i just cannot wait to get them off this so far just feels really really comfortable and really soft and really just smooth i really liked the applicators too i felt like it was really easy to get like a smooth line on the top and the bottom with the applicator I feel like it was just enough of that like pointed tip obviously it can never be too much so even if it was a little more pointed that would be nice but this was really really easy to work with so I feel like I don't have anything neg I guess I do have one tiny little thing I don't know if you guys could see what I'm seeing but I almost feel like after I put this on and with the other color too, you could almost see like every little line in my lips. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, um, but with other lip products, I don't typically see it as much. With this one, I do feel like it's kind of accentuating those lines a little bit, which I could do without, but maybe that's on me. Maybe it's too much product. Maybe it's just the product itself. I'll keep you guys posted in the near future as I like play around with these a little bit more. But overall, for a first impression, I feel like I'm really, really impressed with what these are. Like I'm just still, I can't get over the fact that I'm like talking and forgetting that I have product on my lips because it feels like nothing and it's not drying and it feels good and it looks good. Like I just think these are they check all the boxes in like what someone would look for in a liquid lipstick especially the fact that they feel so smooth and not dry at all. So, so far, I really, really love them. I'm going to have to get the other shade that was out of stock when I tried to get it because I'm really curious about that one now. But overall, 
love the product love the two shades that i got i'm definitely going to be using these over and over again i think they are beautiful i think they are so worth it and the packaging itself i just cannot stop staring so two thumbs up it's a yes but that is it i hope you guys enjoyed comment and let me know what you think about the shades about the product itself let me know your thoughts give this a huge thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel but stay tuned and i will see you guys in the next video